Hey guys, welcome back to MWG Garage. Today we have this couple mowers that we're going to try and work on. They're free mowers to us so we can see if we can try and get them running. This is a Toro 6.5 horsepower push mower. It has a self-propel system where if you push down on the handle, it, it drags itself forward with the four-wheel system or the self-propelled system. Don't know if any of this stuff works, like I said. It was free, so we're gonna go over the basics and see if we can get this one running. So now I'm just gonna go and see if there's any fluids that have been left in it. So I'm gonna take off this gas cap real quick. Well, there's no gas in it, but there's some grass in it. So that won't get you nowhere. I you'll probably see it down in there. Some old grass shavings. And check the oil. Well, it has oil, needs some, but it's a good sign that it has some. Well, now that I, since, since I know it has oil, I'm gonna see if I can get it to pull over real quick. Yeah, I'm working on a truck bed because it's easier for me to work with other than when you need to do this. Perfect. Has good compression. That's a good sign. Yeah, like I said, it was free. This, the joint right here is missing so I'll we'll probably find a bolt for that to put onto it so yeah that one side still has it this side broke off so now we're at the car carburetors it's right here I'm gonna take the air cleaner off air cleaner looks relatively clean for being free doesn't smell like gas so I think it's good Carburetor is right here. It's, this is an old style car. Well, I don't know if it's an old one or not, but it's just as the old plastic or a metal fuel bowl gone into the intake right there. So now that we saw that it turns over, I'm just going to take off the cover and see if there's any critters living inside. Uh, it's only two, two of the four bolts are holding this cover on, but I'd say two out of four is only 50%, but it doesn't. Not harm or nothing, because it's just a little plastic cover just to make it look presentable. I'm not really doing all that much. Man. You can see, no critters, but you can tell it hasn't been cleaned out. All the dust from mowing lawns and uh, things like that come with the carpet. Even the carburetor's all gummed up. You can tell it ha hasn't seen the light of day in a little while. And you can tell it's all looking fine. I'm gonna get a spark plug tester and put it on there. I hope it has spark. I wonder if you guys will be able to see it or not. Spark plug tester. Maybe you guys might be able to see this. I got the carburetor off. Just gonna look at the internals. I got the main bolt screw off. Looks pretty clean. There's no, there was nothing in the float bowl. I'm gonna try and take this off carefully because gasket, the gasket's cracked, but it might be okay. See the float bowls in here? It looks pretty clean inside here, so must not have been run very long. So I'm gonna probably just blow through it a little bit, see if this the needle and seat work. So I'm gonna blow through it real quick. Needle and seat do work. So that's about. Looks like everything else is. All the holes in the jets are all clear, so I might just put this back on and uh, put it right back on and it'll be ready to go. So, just put this on, probably throw some fuel in, and it'll probably work just fine. Who knows? So, all we did to it was uh, open the carburetor, saw that it was clean, cleaned out the gas tank, put some fresh fuel in it, and 
See if we can do this with one hand. There. And the propulsion unit works. So now we're gonna make this into one video. We have another old lawnmower sitting in the back of there. We're gonna try and add on to this one, see what we could do.